In early 2020, National Highways discovered structural issues on the 50-year-old A52 Clifton Bridge over the River Trent in Nottingham. VSL has worked closely with National Highways to deliver a fast-track design and build solution based on the use of external post-tensioning, while keeping the bridge open. Self-delivery by our highly skilled teams and a strong focus on safety, quality and environmental constraints have been the foundation for the project's successful on-time completion. Clifton Bridge is a very complex structure with multiple concrete box girders and a combination of bonded and unbonded post-tensioning. When problems were discovered with the bridge, the owner contacted VSL and we helped them by carrying out specialist investigations and a structural assessment. The knowledge we gained from this allowed us to offer a full solution on a design and build basis to bring the bridge back to where it should be. This approach allowed the works to start before the design was even complete. And this was only possible through proactive management of the design and a close cooperation between the technical and the production teams. Ultimately, we're able to deal with a vast number of constraints and deliver this bridge much faster than a traditional approach would have allowed us to do. The primary process of ensuring a safe operations on site is facilitated by VSL hazard and risk assessment process, in which each scope is to be performed is identified, listed and assessed in terms of method statements, scope and associated hazards, and we put in place the needed prevention measures to keep the workforce safe. On this project, we have taken special care on the interface with the public and the environmental impact that the, the works could bring to the location where we are working. One example uh, is the temporary footbridge we have erected to allow the workforce to cross from the work area on span 2 to the work area close to the south abutment. That footbridge allowed the workforce to cross the live uh, traffic on Clifton Lane without leaving uh, the work area, in fact. Working next to one of the UK's largest rivers brings a number of challenges. We worked closely with the Environment Agency and Canals and River Trust to gain specific permits to conduct the works over the river. Managing the risk of flooding was a significant challenge which had to be factored into the design of temporary works and compound areas. All scaffold platforms were designed with additional reinforcement to cope with the forces introduced by the flood waters. The compound was designed by evacuated within a few hours of receiving a flood warning. All welfare units, generators and stores located on the compound are towable and can be removed by side vehicles and stored in a safe location away from the flood waters. As a project, we are committed to diverting more waste from landfill, reusing and recycling as many materials as possible. We have introduced a smart waste management plan on site, utilizing online technology to track monitor and improve our waste management practices. We are also reducing our carbon footprint by utilizing smart distribution boxes for the site which divert power only to where it is needed, helping to reduce our fuel consumption. National Highways needed a fast track design and build solution to reopen all the lanes on Clifton Bridge as soon as possible. We were able to do that because we have all the local expertise to self-deliver the project. I am very proud of what our teams have achieved under immense time pressure whilst keeping traffic flowing at all times.